Location, location, location. Biggest question that we always get from a lot of our investors when they're looking at the best location to invest in that's going to be gaining them uh, potentially lots of return on that investment. My name is Fadi Kudair. I'm a local realtor here with Sutton, Ottawa. Come in here and let's explain to you why location matters. Understanding the importance of location for your real estate property, especially when you're looking at a commercial property, you really want to set yourself up for success. The biggest thing for location is making sure that that location, whether it's going to be a retail outlet or Essentially, it's going to be in an office. You want it to be accessible. You want it to be easy for the folks to come in. A big question that we get a lot of the times, especially on the office side, accessibility, especially for uh, folks that are in a wheelchair, what have you. Uh, you know, especially, for example, if we're looking at a clinic, you want to have that little bit of flexibility. You want to be able to come in and out. You want to have that sort of ease for the client that's going to be using that particular asset. Location, when you're looking at retail, really matters. Uh, specifically, when we're looking at a storefront, we want to be in a plaza or on a Main Street to allow for a lot of eyeballs to take a look at that store. Uh, what that means for the retail outlet, lots of clients going to be coming by. Foot traffic is very heavy. The rent for sure will also be a little bit on the higher side. Or if you're buying it, obviously the asset itself is going to be a little bit more expensive. However, the return on investment is going to be massive for that retail store because they have that foot traffic. They have that sort of abundance of clients coming in uh, to be able to suffice for the business. Another big one for location is overlooking future development, especially on the commercial or residential side, it doesn't matter really. When you're looking at location, you really have to pay attention to what's coming down the pipe. A lot of the times, especially on the commercial side, one of the things that we do for our clients is future study. And what that means is that being able to do that bit of a due diligence, sit down with the city, have a, a bit of an understanding of what sort of the next five to 10 year plan that they have in mind as far as being able to uh, understand what's coming down. For example, if we're looking at a retail store and you know that you know five years down the road, they're going to be building a highway next to it, well, definitely that's not really a good location. If you're looking at a condo and you understand that, you know, maybe in a couple of years, there's going to be a train track coming in there, definitely not a great location. So future planning is very important for the business. It's very important for any sort of real estate asset that you're going to invest in. And it will also make it or break it when it comes to that asset appreciating or depreciating. Nobody wants to buy an asset that's going to be depreciating at the end of the day, that's losing your money. You want to be able to build wealth and build profit. You buy an asset that's going to be appreciating. Some of the biggest frustration that we get from a lot of clients that we're working on when it comes to location is that a ability to look at the future planning. What that means, a lot of the times clients just go by the seat of their pants, they'll go and buy any sort of property just because they have a little bit of uh, emotional tie into it. What we find with commercial, emotions are the last thing you want to bring into the commercial investment. Uh, you want to be able to sit down and really have a clear vision of what's coming down the pipe, have a clear vision about the return on investment that that property is bringing, and have a clear vision about what type of use are you going to have with that particular property. And that's going to allow you to excel. It's going to allow you to be able to uh, get the proper return on investment for that property. For more tips like this, please don't forget to hit the like button. If you like what you see, subscribe to the channel. My name is Fadi Kudair and it's Canada on the Rocks. Love to see you for some more.